Hi, in this video, I'm going to be showing you a free website traffic generator that you can use to generate quick traffic to your website, blog, or video. I'm Vince from Digital Nomad Institute, and let's get started. So before we go into that, I just want to show you what didn't work. And for me, a lot of the traffic generators that didn't work was Pinterest. I used it for three, four, five months posting things on here, and it just never took off. It, it was just you get 14 and nothing, nothing, one, nothing, four. And, and the same was true with Facebook and Twitter. So I tried many other websites, and I tried a lot of these other free so-called uh, traffic generators on tra tap. None of them worked. However, out of these ones that I did try for several, uh, several months, the one that really worked and worked well was Quora. And the reason, the benefit for, the, for using Quora and the reason why I think it worked is because, number one, it's ranked 74 globally, right? Or worldwide rank is 74. That's, that's really high. The other thing about Quora is it's ranked 60 within the U.S. and... It has a uh, 618 million visits. All right, that, that that is that is amazing, with a really like low, relatively low bounce rate. So this is very very highly targeted traffic uh, coming to Quora that you can tap and take advantage of. And this is just not me speaking from theory. As you know, everything I do, it's either well researched or, or mostly I've done it myself. All right, I like to speak from firsthand experience if I can, when I can. And this is the case right now. Uh, this is, I've been using Quora and I've been getting fantastic results using it to generate targeted traffic. And these are all my stats right here. This is just me using it part-time testing within the same period as I was testing Pinterest, Quora, uh, Facebook, and, and Twitter. And none of those got results. This one did. Right? Can you imagine? This is just me putting a little bit of effort in. Can you imagine if I put more effort into this? And as you can see, you get a few visits here, here, here. But these are very highly targeted traffic um, vi uh, visits. Right? These are very, very highly tar targeted views. So because they're going to this question, looking for an answer, and then reading your answer, liking your answer, reading your answer, and then, sh and then that's what it counts as a view. So look, look at these views, right? So I know what some of you might be thinking. Oh, it's just 12 views here, 17 views here, 23 views here, 29 views here, 100, 400 views here. Well, if you add them up, it becomes a couple thousand, you know, and they add up. And it's all high-quality traffic, very, very, very high-quality traffic. So in order to – how this works in order to use Quora as a free website traffic generator – what you simply do is you answer questions. I'm going to keep it very simple. You answer questions according to your niche. So, for example, if I'm in weight loss, right? So I type in uh, weight loss. All right. You just type in weight loss and search for it. Uh, you get a whole bunch of different, uh, you can just go to questions. You got a whole bunch of different questions. What are the best weight loss pills? Let's go ahead and, and type that in. See what see what comes out. All right, whole bunch of different questions, and you have a lot of answers in here. All right, and what you can do is you can just go ahead and answer, uh, answer the the uh, the questions related to your niche. All right, and yeah, you can argue that yeah, you won't get the uh, first place. You won't get many views if you're first place. Uh, or second place or you know so on and so forth but look if someone if you can make it within if you can answer the question you will get some traffic even if you don't make it to the first the first obviously is the best but I'm gonna show you how you can increase your chances of getting not only getting to the first place of any answer that you uh, you know that you answer on Quora to, to increase your chances but also to do it effortlessly because let's face it if you had to answer this question manually let's say you go ahead and and uh, answer this question right here and then you typed everything out that would be very 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 time-consuming all right but 
if you use a special tool and technique that I'm about to show you, you can get this done really quickly and you can build up traffic and snowball it over time. And that tool that I like to use is Writer. Right? So Writer, for those of you who don't know, is an AI writing tool that basically writes and answers, um, basically writes answers to many in many different types of formats, video ideas, description, blog posts, and it answers it for you. It writes the answer for you like like a human would. Very very uh, very decent quality writing at a very affordable price. So let me go ahead and uh, let me see what would I but oh right here. All right, so I go to blog section writing, and all I do is just simply. Let me move this over to here. I simply go back here, take the question, go back here. Uh, let me go back to blog writing ideas. Sorry. Pop it in here. Click uh, creativity level. I like um, I like medium. Okay, I'm gonna set the creativity level to medium, and I'm gonna click on write for me. I'm going to let it run. And this is what you have. First, it's going to generate the outline for you. Okay. And then what you do is it's going to generate the keywords. You highlight both. All right. And you click on paragraph. What it's going to do is it's going to write a paragraph that includes the keywords in here. All right. That's if you want to optimize it. If you don't, you go ahead, delete it, and uh, you can just write it without the keywords. But I prefer to optimize it. So I'm going to just click on paragraph. For each one, change the date for this. Click on paragraph again. All right, and click on another paragraph for the last one. All right, and I'm going to delete the keywords here. Delete the, uh, let's see, the keywords. Delete the keywords here. And I got about 450 words. That's good enough. All right. If I want to add more, I can go ahead and add more, but I'm going to keep it as is. I'm going to go ahead and press Control C here. Then I'm going to, just, just for quality assurance, I'm going to go ahead and check it with Grammarly uh, I'm gonna go ahead and check it with a third a, a, another app which is a Grammarly it's a AI grammar checker click on you and I'm gonna paste my content that I got from the AI writer into here uh, I'm gonna set it I'm gonna set this to neutral inform let me convince and then click done and it's gonna go in it's going to help me to maybe clarify this a bit. Okay. Okay. All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and make this minor corrections using Grammarly. Uh, I think this this one's going to. All right. Let me rephrase this. All right. So now look at the overall score: ninety-eight. Um, it has very clear clarity, engagement, very engagement, and delivery is just right. Now, the most important thing I want to check for, of course, is plagiarism. I want to make sure this is a unique content. Right? It also helped my chances. And it says 
uh, is about 14% plagiarism. The rest is unique. So you're looking about 86% uh, uniqueness. All right, that's pretty good. Right, control C to copy, and then I just go to Cora and go ahead and paste this. Now, if I want to increase my chances, I can add images. I can go ahead and you know weight loss best weight loss pill. Just type in here best weight loss pill. Get some kind of nice image. Maybe this one. Uh, hmm. Save image. And then all I all I do is I uh, I go back, add the image here. Okay, so it has a nice image to draw the eye in. It has a good good title. It has a nice long, nice long paragraph. All right. And you can go ahead and post it. Okay. And of course, you can you can choose your your credentials. Uh, I'm gonna leave it at that. But the reason why this helps you to rank is because longer content tends to do better on Quora, and you're giving out more information, so Cora t more unique information, so Cora tends to like it. All right, so you have a higher chance of ranking for the, for the top. And you know, I know it took a, a bit of a while for me to explain it, but if I didn't have to explain it and you just knew how to do uh, did this and just did the the task itself, just pop the question in here, get the outline, expand the outline, and then take whatever's here and put it into into Quora, and you do this five, six, seven, eight times, nine times, ten times. Well, then, slowly over time, your traffic starts to increase, and you're gonna get, you know, more and more, you know, of these. Each, like, let's say each question only gets you ten views um, a month. Let's say even a month, ten views, four views, seven views. Let's say ten views a month. But if you have ten questions a day, that's hundred views a month and then you keep stacking it you can see how the traffic will build up over time right using this method this this right here this is all done uh, up, up until this part right here <laughs> this was all done manually and then after here I started doing uh, uh, just using doing the same thing but a little bit more using the system I just taught you and it's increasing my traffic without increasing my workload so there you have it. You can use the combination of AI plus Cora to turn it into a free traffic generator for your website, video, or blog. And if you want to learn more about this, I'm going to leave a link in the description below so you can go ahead and check it out to see if you're interested. And I'll show you the pros and cons of this right? and see whether it or not it's right for you. Um, as well, just, <clears throat> just to let you know, I made a... Uh, AI YouTube course that shows you how to use AI tools such as this to grow your small channel and to also make money before and during monetization. So if you're interested in that, you can go ahead and check that out in the description link below as well. I hope this video was helpful, and if it was, could you please hit the like button? I'm Vince from Digital Nomad Institute, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.